We're gonna slam some terrors, I think. Y'all? I hope this does a trick. Nah, I'm sorry guys, we're flipping off. I don't care, like... <laughs> I don't care what you say, we're doing it. We're doing it. This is value though. We ate. <laughs> we did good. What's up and welcome everyone to a new Lost Cameras of Ixalan standard video and today Chad has challenged me to make a teamer spell stack work. So this deck revolves around two cards, Hearth Elemental and Talarian Terror. Now both Hearth Elemental and Talarian Terror get discounted in cost based on the amount of instants and sorceries in your graveyard. So in this deck we're playing a lot of cheap spells to fill up the graveyard quickly with cards like Consider, Otherworldly Gaze and Sight of Hand. Now both the Terror and the Hearth are also above 5 mana value. So that makes the cards trigger up the Beanstalk, which can make for some incredibly explosive turns where we can draw multiple cards of playing 1 mana creatures. And playing green also allows us to play Questing Druid that also has synergy with the cheap spells since it will grow quickly because of them and can also find us our cheap spells with its adventure side. Now unfortunately, interaction isn't great in deck, so we just have to work with some red removal spells like Strangle, Obliterating Bolt and Witch Talker Frenzy and hope for the best. So this deck is definitely not tier 1 or anything, but it's capable of some insanely explosive turns, which makes it incredibly fun to play. And on top of that, outside of the lands of course, the deck is basically a budget deck with only a few rares needed to play. Alright, let me know in the comments what deck you would like to see me Brewer play next, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. Now let's start slinging some spells. This video is brought to you by Ultimate Guard. Ultimate Guard provides you with premium protection for your trading cards, ranging from sleeves, deck boxes, playmats, binders, and more. Ultimate Guard has everything you need to keep your magic cards safe, secure, and stylish. Support the channel and yourself by purchasing your Ultimate Guard products using the link in the description. Being able to play creatures as 2 2 wards for 3 doesn't totally suck. I mean, it kind of does. Like I said, the depends on the format again. Kind of sucks. Like in this economy for three mana, we're casting creatures, we're casting Rafines, we're casting Haughty Jins, we're casting, you know, Sentinels, we're casting like a two mana three three is never worth it. You're thinking limited. Yeah, I'm thinking constructed always on this channel, so. It's, it, it clearly is a limited mechanic, that's what I said when I read it. It's just another way for like limited to like fill your curve and make it feel better. Like crafting allows you to do some more stuff. I think they're like the current um, play design team just goes hard on wanting to avoid dead turns in limited, I think. And that's nothing wrong with that. At all, of course. But yeah, that's kind of just like what it's been like recently. They just want to avoid dead turns. And so far, Murders at Carl of Manor seems very much focused on um, being a good limited set and giving a commander player some new toys. That's kind of what it sees like, what it feels like so far. Draw go and limited is horrible. Yeah, it really is. It really is like terrible. So. big assassin's trophy i was pretty hyped about assassin's trophy and the chat was like why the fuck are you hyped about assassin's trophy <laughs> i was pretty excited but i guess we have a lot better nowadays don't we uh, 2019 ash was kind of hyped That's unfortunate. All right, let's keep it going. Um, I can give myself a Jin and a Druid. I enjoy Astro. I enjoy Astro too. I guess like once at some point in like a standard, you're gonna be especially like Golgari mid range. You're gonna like run into a moment in the game where it doesn't really matter whether or not you give your opponent a land. I guess. Not a whole lot of like basics played and i mean i guess especially against shit like esper 
You know, I, Esper can play many basics, can it? Actually, don't know. Never counted. Yeah, I guess we'll see. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Yeah, anyway, I'm still, like, pretty hyped, I guess. Hyped enough. The new Boros Anthem. Yeah, the new Boros Anthem does work with O'Hare Eshenil, so... <laughs> so, time to inhale some Copium again, I guess. Mm, I'll take another gin. The last app was good from Strike Matter, Watch for Limited. Really? I still liked Ixel Unlimited. I don't know. I liked it. I was a fan. But I'm also not like a hardcore limited player or anything, so I haven't like done like 50 games with it or something. I quite like the yeah. It's no Crimson Vow, but it's also no Kamigawa. <laughs> so it's no Kamigawa, it's also no Crimson Vow, so yeah. Do with that what you will. Yeah. I could get an instant speed free to fade to try and buff these questing crews up a bit more. I'll probably do it. Free to fade and a free to fade. Um, why not, I guess. Kamigawa. Oh, Kamigawa, yeah. Kamigawa. I think everybody is going to feel Kamigawa leaving. I mean, I'm doing 12 right now. Can I ever do more? No, I can't. Yeah, Kamigawa leaving standard is going to hurt. I mean, I know, obviously, like, it's going to be something that we celebrate, but also, like, not. You know? It's gonna be very much like double-edged sword vibes. I think. Good riddance. Yeah, but also like, you know. Yeah, like, you know, the greatest loss from Kamigawa is gonna be the channel lands too, you know, guys? Like, we've taken these channel lands for granted, truly, and like, they're <laughs> they're fucking good. Like, they're fucking good. I'm gonna be really upset by nifty channel lands. The slow lands. Oh, the slow lands are coming? Oh, the slow lands are crimson bow. Yeah, they're gonna be gone too. Jesus. We might actually have to play with surreal lands now. A nightmare. Oh yeah, channel lands are very busted, but like that's not th not necessarily um a bad thing in standard, you know. Domain just plows. Yeah, domain is a true villain. <laughs> domain is a true villain, I fear. No. Okay, I can keep this. I have to seek the beast. I have Tolarian Terror. We gotta consider, I guess. However, two pain lands. Dun, dun, dun. Can we survive? I don't know. The gaze. Villain. I mean, definitely the villain. In my opinion. Definitely the villain. What what Twitter thinks Judith is going to be is actually what a track size is. <laughs> it's like trench warfare. Um Yeah, I'm quite happy with all of these. Okay. That's my goofy turn. Yeah, domain doesn't rotate, especially now that they have to surveil lands, so... Yeah. 
Only Stumper rotates. Okay, Stumper is, uh, what is it? Um, yeah, the thingy. Gangster set. Yeah, tr Triumphs rotate, but they get the surveillance now, so... That's not bad. If you really want to get, like, the domain tags... Then again, like, we all know, like, everybody in this chat that plays Standard has probably at some point in time lost to a domain player that only played Basics. <laughs> like... like Unfortunately, Domain can very easily play with just fetching whatever colors need. However, that does get worse without the dinosaur, so... It does get worse without the dinosaur. But can't they still do like... I guess that... I don't know. I guess you also can't do like those SNC lands that then like allow you to grab a land. Whatever they're called. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe. I still think Domain can survive though. But... Spelunking? Oh yeah, they can do Spelunking too. That's right. That's right. That is right. Go for Fetch's basics. Glimpse into Spelunking. Yeah, it'll just they'll adapt for sure, I think, for sure. Mon oh my god, that's true. Mono red versus Kumano. <gasps> that's devastating. That's really. Oh my god. We do hate to see it. God, all these like token decks is just so bad for us. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. We're just playing like big boys. We can't really handle tokens. I mean, I maybe I should have brought in Brotherhood's End. I don't know, but uh, Wedding Leaves, true. A lot of really, really good cards rotate. Well, I got this, and I can pull the tag. I can then. Tracks us fall wedding. Oh, and the blue march goes too. No. I'll grab druid. Thanks. Crazy nobody knew wedding was gonna be good. Well, it was different times, you know, Kiki Jiki existed. <laughs> Kiki was around, so you know. Kiki was a player. Alright, I need to like build this board up. So it was Meat Hook until ban. Unban Meat Hook. <laughs> Challenge. <laughs> Unban Meat Hook. It would be a dream. Meet Hook Massacre and Massacre Girl. Together, thriving. Okay. Why was banned? It just did a lot. Like there were just a lot of like um 
black decks in the meta at that point, and um, it's real big. There's just a lot of like black decks in the meta at that point, and you know every deck was like, all right, might as well play some meat hook massacres because it was kind of like free to do. So. Yeah, like, at that point, like, the, the Mono Black was a really strong deck, too. So, uh... Wait, did it tap red? Why? Wait, why? Wait, why? Oh my god, I'm in trouble now. Oh my god. Why tap red? Alright, whatever. Now I'm screwed. I didn't check it. R.I.P. Alright, I'm just gonna concede. I uh, might need to play my brother's hands. Um, no? <laughs> Please give me a decent hand. We have raiders coming in. You can't give me four beans, dude! Alright, we're doomed. We're actually doomed. God, is this deck gonna win one game? I don't know. It's a good question. Shit. Trench warfare. I guess discard your hand and draw two cards. Like I, I guess so. I guess so. Hmm. It's fine. <laughs> I mean, nah. Uh... Just trying to get to a spot where I can fire off Hearth Elemental and like be okay with it, you know? Prankster is okay. If I can win this on a mold of four, I'd be pretty happy, but I fucking doubt it. Let's see though. We'll see, we'll see. Here. And then we're gonna do genius. Stoke genius. Beans! Oh shit, maybe we're in this. Okay, maybe we're in this. This could be huge. This could be huge. Okay, okay, hold on. No. <laughs> Where does the Carl of Manor? We're reading the lore together, maybe. Oh shit. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Could we thrive? Maybe. Mm, let's... I mean, I could try to hit a land here. Try. Well, <laughs> try and succeed. Um, sure. Play this, uh, this bestie out. We should play the new Surveil Lands. <laughs> um, I, I don't know about that. I don't know. I don't know about that. I don't know if I would. I don't know, I don't know about that. And or have an adventure. All right, let's get this hit by the 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 wandering hag. I imagine. Don't do it. Get lost. All right. Shh. Sure. Let's have a free to pay moment. Look, 
Loki, I'm gonna grab that march. I'm not gonna get bullied. That could be pretty good. Alright, pass my turn. Well, Brother Tent's good. That's good, you guys. Also, for the Raiders, we are playing this uh, Teamer Spells deck after chat voted for it. We're currently also doing a prediction where, um, oh, what the hell? AO? Where um, people, like, just place their bets on how they think the deck will do in, like, five sets of best of three. No. Well, that does remove AO. I'm nervous, but I think I'm going to try. Score at the moment, 0-1. Unfortunately. I'll put the record up on screen. Just get something, like, bad. <laughs> Please. Just something bad. What did they get? Let's see. For in before counters, that would be incredible. Ah, oh, shit! I'm not happy with that either. Of course, they hit a four drop. Shit. <sighs> okay, that's not good. Scammed. Rigged. Double book it, but Sarah Paragon, I dare you. You know what? Maybe my best bet is to just like march their Sarah Paragon and try to win with my gin. At this point. I don't know. It's gonna take me like eight spells, but. <laughs> We gotta believe in something, y'all. We gotta believe in something. Just literally phase out the whole board. Brotherhood's end plus march. Get rid of all blockers. Thrive. I'm gonna try it. Ooh, that's a mistake. That's greed right there. That is greed right there. Ooh. Now I'm just gonna gaze like right now. They're being greedy. The greed. So um let me actually think about this. So I need like three mana total for March and Brotherhood's end. This March gets becomes free with Potty Jin. That puts two spells in the grave, put Jin up to nine. Carrier swings for five. You're swinging for 14. You then have two map tokens. I get, actually no, it doesn't work that way because this gets exiled. Um. Hold on a second. Um, okay, yeah, no, I gotta put all in the bin. I'm just trying to figure it out. Yo, Drum, thank you for the 17. Appreciate you so much. Thank you. Hold on, we can get out of this. So these two go in the grave. I can keep the questing druid on top so that my map tokens hit right. Uh, it's gonna be Brotherhood's End. Deal three damage. Then it's gonna be Exus One. Sarah Paragon. 
and we've surveilled i mean it already does it but we've like surveilled drew it to the top so you can technically be like oh wow look at me go hey i mean it's only because they got like super greedy with that virtue but like we got there it's rough out here we're gonna keep it All right, we're just gonna have to believe. The second we get these discounts on these stairs, we're good to go. Yeah, we're just gonna do that one. Three terrors. I mean, this is broken. Come on now. This is it. Okay. Ready for it, y'all. We're gonna get super discounted now. I'm hyped. Fuck. <laughs> okay, um... Well... Well, I mean... Okay, I milled four cards. Let's see. Discard hand. <laughs> I'm good. God, okay. It's really not giving, is it? I guess we got a strangle. Sure, why not? Why not? Nah, we're doing it, guys. We're doing it. We just have to find our cheap spells. Somewhere. <laughs> eventually. Somewhere eventually. Okay, that's pretty bad. Well, she can actually put an instant for me to grab. This hits Planeswalkers? Um, vibes. Stop! <laughs> it's no longer funny. Oh my god. Well, eventually we're gonna pop off like a playset. You just wait, y'all. You just wait. This is gonna do it. Oh. Fucking hell. All right, beans. I don't know. Well, better than nothing. All right. I'm going to pop off with these beans. Like, you guys just wait. This is actually just like model black like, planeswalkers. RIP me. I'm gonna create a bunch of like tokens. We are way too slow. Shit. Beans. Okay, I consider that's a dream. Um. All right, casting a terror, guys. Let's go. Uh, what do we need here? I mean, they're all pretty bad, but... Okay. Now, we could pop off. I guess. Two mana, five, five, draw two? See, that's gonna get in somewhere. Let's get in there. Get in there. You have full faith. Right, right, right. <laughs> right, right, right. Ah, you just wait. Fuck around, find out. Damn. That's gone. Well, that doesn't really work. I'm just trying to figure out. You can do 
Terangle into Triple Terror and hold a Fading Hope, maybe? I'm trying to figure out where I'm supposed to go, though. Fading Hope, your own prankster. Am I actually gonna, like, board wipe? Am I at risk of getting board wiped? I fucking hope not, but I might. I got the resource keep up with beans. I hope we don't. So we're gonna slam some pears, I think. I hope it's just a trick. Surely they can't like survive all that. Oh my god, we even have an elemental here. Nah, I'm sorry guys, we're flipping off. I don't care, like, <laughs> I don't care what you say, we're doing it. We're doing it. This is fucking value though, shit. Y'all? No fear we play into it, right? Well, no, that's it. Pass my turn. We ate. <laughs> we did good. Okay, that's a, you can yeah, that's allowed. We did good, you guys. I'll just get rid of the Yavi Maya and um consider I guess. I'll hold the fading hopes. She's popping off. Okay, it's fine. She's a star. Do I need to? Do I have bases? I don't think so. Oh well. Oh no. <laughs> well, we did it, y'all. <laughs> we did it, though. Like, these people that are on Twitter and that have, like, the, the urge, like, that feel like they have the right to open their mouth, like, and talk about... Yeah, Judith... Okay, I'm gonna say Judith auto-winning on Resolve against everything but combo. Say less. Oh my god. Buying 500 copies. 500 copies. Can't wait to play this in Modern. No, Legacy. There you go. Like, it's unreal. Like, the, these people, like... It's like, <laughs> it's just insane. <laughs> Imagine looking at Judith and like, yeah, this card just wins if it gets, if it resolves. Like, it doesn't die to any regular removal. Holy shit. Like, the, dis the, the disconnect of it all is mind-blowing. That might be the case for, like, a non-removed Atraxa, but Judith? Adoken, thank you for the Prime. Thank you. The worst thing about Judith is like once I play my five drop, I'm I'm like expected to have a hand stacked with one drops to get a lot of value. Like that's where she gets horrible too. Like only in Commander can you like get away with a five drop and perhaps have like five other spells in your hand, cheap like cantrip effects to really take advantage of like generating two tubes. Like in Standard, by the time I can play a five drop, I won't really have much left, unfortunately. That's just, that's just the way it is.
Nah, it's true. But the, when I said she would have maybe done something at three, people lost their shit. Now, I am saying, like, what format exactly is she going to be memorable in as not a sacrifice card? Like, as an aristocrat card, she might have done something. Maybe. But no. Um, I don't want to get to Shauna's requesting, but I already have it, Shauna. I'm just trying to figure out how I want to go about this. Because I would like to see all the cards. Um... Possibly okay in limited. She's but like even in limited, like the the Rectos archetype, I'm pretty sure is um aggro suspicious. So unless suspicious stuff means having a lot of instant sorcery, it's just, just like an off-color splash in Izet. Maybe at best. She doesn't like represent the color like pie. I think so. That's kind of like where the problem lies too. I feel, I feel. But like I said, I find it whack. If I'm playing Ravnica Limited and I open a guild leader, which she is, and she doesn't allow me to play that color she doesn't allow me to, like, to play in those colors. I'm kind of pissed. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, that's not... That's not right. I, I don't know why I'm countering this. I get you need to vent about it, but it's just like... It's just the stupidity of it all, you know? It's just the stupidity of it all that blows me away. How can you say that she's like... I can't. Um, I do want to get rid of this thing. It's doing a bit much. There you go. She's a burn card. No, it's like... I don't know what she is, really. Yeah, like, she kind of, like, lacks, like, an EDP effect or some shit like that, too. I'm just passionate about it because Judith was kind of the reason why, like, I kind of fell in love with Magic as a card game. Guilds of Ravnica was, like, my first pre-release. So, the set and the characters, like, mean a lot to me. And obviously, I was very stoked to see Judith back and hoping that it would, like, you know, help my Rectal decks out, not my Izzet decks. <laughs> like or a commander card you know but god forbid like don't don't let reddit know or twitter know whatever mm, i need to stop this stupid rats nah it's true it's true girls just want to have fun I give up on this and just hide behind it. Homie's response was, I know that loads of people thought BRS was mid when it was released. There's room to be surprised. <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay. Just pulling out all the stops to try and prove me wrong. Like... I can't... <laughs> it's like, when is it enough, y'all? Like... You can- it's honestly okay to, like, lose on the internet. It's, like, fine. It's just fine. You, you, you don't have to win every conversation, like... It's crazy as fuck. You have to die on every hill. Nah, it's true, it's true.
people's bad magic takes and wizard ruin ruining characters. Nah, that's true. Those are always given. Trouble? Nah, that's true, Minus. That's true. How is this is it? <laughs> oh, brother. Like. Oh, brother. Um, I mean, I need to come up with something good. This is not necessarily bad, though. But gotta hit something. Gotta hit something here. Yeah, like that's gonna be great. I'm I'm happy that Wizards um Wizards saw the urgency to bring Fulter to Arena. I really am happy that they saw that. Thank God. Thank God. I've been like talking about that for a while. We really like just Explorer is just completely unplayable without that card, so at least it gives us a reason to play, like slowly get more into Explorer. I'm really happy they put Fulter in like the instead of some of these like double like it's true because even if you don't care like they took out double double mythics which is great like in, it's instead of like I, I know one is instead of like cavalier of thorns which everybody has cavalier of thorns most people so then you don't have to worry about getting like duplicates and instead you get like Hopter, which is pretty fucking sweet like real uh, happy with the arena team for that one Real happy with that, because imagine if we had to wait till the end of 2024 to play Copter. Like, that would have been a disaster. Truly. That would have been an absolute disaster. So, yeah. Thank God. Wait, what? Terror Tide? Okay, man. Cannot channel. Ugh. Besties, I am in big trouble. Okay, I, the psychic damage I've taken on fucking Twitter today is like unreal. It's just unreal. <laughs> I don't think my brain will ever uh, will ever recover. Yeah. This is why I like I rarely tweet. I just hang out on Discord. Did not think that when I spoke of a red black card saying whenever you cast an instant or sorcery, and I said, well, this isn't really on brand, people would be uh mad about that. <laughs> it's fine. It's true, it's true. Every day I fear. All right, well, you're a little bit too late, so we're going to have to concede this one. These planeswalkers are killing us. Mm, no. Is Judith Commander playable? I don't know. I don't play Commander. I mean, everything is Commander playable. If you try hard enough, if you want to make a Judith Commander deck, I'm sure there's like some enough cards in the game to build a deck around her. I'm sure. And just build a commander around whatever, right? So I can build these cards, I guess. Nah, that's true. I 
I kind of want to hit a land. I could try with this. I think we'll just play beans. I guess I'll play beans. Hybrid has been fire. Good draw, good draw. I have the floors right now. Beans in the land. Yeah, we, we vibe. We vibe. I gotta find like red or something somewhere. What do you think of new Kellen? I would probably play like, I would probably try like two Kellens at the top ending PPs for sure. For sure. I'm getting all the lens, but not red. Bench. Not giving. Mugworth, thank you, Rudy15. Appreciate you. Uh, what am I gonna do, guys? This is not giving me what I needed to give. It's just not. We're just not finding red lands. I can try to dig more for it, though. I can't seek the beast. Alright. Um, yeah, this is looking rough as fuck. Yikes. Phase down disguise mechanics. Yeah, it's not great. <laughs> it's not great. No respect bluffs on arena. It's just gonna be like so predictable at some point, you know. It's com it's gonna be like the same shit as like um uh I always forget the name. Oh god, it's gonna be the same shit as uh foretelling. We just know what they foretold. <laughs> it's like you're not fooling anybody. It's gonna be cute for a little bit and like limited, I guess. That's where it's gonna be like pretty fun. But even limited players, eventually you're gonna like figure out what it says. I think so. Eventually in Limited, you're going to be able to predict which one they grab, too. I got red! Oh, wow! Ain't no way! I'm at 8 life, though, so it's not going to mean much. But, yo, I got it. Crying, shaking, throwing up. Poison the cup. <laughs> yeah. Goofy. No, don't tap red. Don't you dare. It took us forever to get here. Oh. I mean, Skitter is just so bad. Skitter, like, hard countering his whole deck. Trench. I'm just dead. I don't know why I'm still in this. I'm just gonna concede it. Yeah, it was always, like, Alrin's were, like... At best, it was, like, the, um... Uh, the board wipe. Scar. Okay. One. Land. Caps. Rip. Oh. Please. Be fucking nice. We're already struggling. Don't kick somebody when they're down, deck. I guess I can't be greedy with beans. I want to be, though. Shit. Anyway, I think like this, maybe. 
We try again, gamers. Oh, a ginger. Oh, Ooh. a ginger brew. A best. A best. Is this artifacts or are you cookies? What are you? Yo. Potentially. God, I don't think it'd be cookies. Like, I gotta be real. <laughs> I gotta be real. Ah, I guess. I guess. So sleight of hand at least make her, makes the Earth Elemental Woman play. It's cookies. Oh fuck. <laughs> We're gonna get stormed by our own creation, I fear. Stormed by our own creation. I, you know what? I do have Brother Sand in the sideboard. I hate to do it to him, but I do have it. God, what a good deck, isn't it, guys? What a great deck. Ooh, who came up with that? I mean, Beans is good, but... Alright, yeah. I have the cast first element right now, or, like, Hell breaks loose. Okay. Um, yeah, maybe after sideboarding we stand a chance here. Brotherhood's end in a dream. Actively dig for it. They might not expect it from us. Oh my god. <laughs> nah. I'm dead as fuck. That's it. Send tweet. Jesus. Cookies is strong. Got some like good stuff in here, potentially. I'll, I mean, maybe I'll be greedy as fuck and go sleight of hand, but. Uh, should I? Should I? No, I shouldn't. Should I? I should be greedy. No. Okay. Oh shit, that's a wormlet. Okay. Not too many lands now. Not like that. Not like that. Two wormlets. Uh oh. Let's get pretty scary. I would like to find Brother Zen pretty soon. Thanks. Strangle. Let me consider first, see if I can hit Brother Zen anyway. You're not bad. You're not good, but you're not bad. I'll draw it. I gotta remove one of these. All right, well, at least we're casting Hearth Elemental soon. We got that going for us. Brothers End 1. All right, Hearth Elemental. Beans. You know, that's not bad. Okay. Let's see. We're honestly off to a pretty okay start here. We're off to an okay start. This might even be better as like a best of one deck or some stuff like that too. It's gonna get death touch now, isn't it? Yeah. 
Please we're booking the schooner. So they're gonna attack me. Let me have a look at the other really gaze at first. I can find removal. Uh okay. All EDH TikTokers using it over crime novelist. Oh god, EDH TikTok. That seems like a horrible place. <laughs> that seems like a horrible place to be at. Alright, like them all. Salt Pierce OP? Yeah. What does crime novelist even do? Is that the George Clooney looking at? No. Who's crime novelist? I'll try strangle. I could get hit by Tamio. All right, let me cast Earth Elemental. Crime novelist. I'm gonna have to Google it now. Second artifact to get one counter in red mana. Oh, the goblin. Oh. Oh. Yeah, no, this was what we're saying. Like, Kellen is, like, going to end up, like, Kellen's story is going to end with Kellen turning into a five-color ma five magic god. Collect all five Kellen's, like, infinity uh, stones and then create Kellen the god. The Goofy Goober. <laughs> the Goofy Goober. Alright, we're gonna have to swing with both Chief, I think. Go Elementals, you got this! Get it, get it going! Rainbow Kellen. Now nah, I'm saying, like, I, I'm serious, I'm serious. It's kind of like the same stuff, like I said, with, with the Preators, right? Where it's like, they're teasing it every set and then it ends up by like, ooh, the Preators are inv invading everything. And Kellen is, yeah, Kellen is gonna do like Power of Friendship vibes. Oh, this looks good though. This looks good. Ooh, that's a search engine, oh no. Yeah, Kellen, Kellen joins like every guilt and snaps the gold with fingers, yeah. Boro, Selesnya, and Simic all written off. The Kellig Zodia. <laughs> Nobody expects it. The Kellig Zodia. Sleight of hand. Really would not mind a brother present here. I'm just saying. It's okay. No. Um, okay, I gotta be careful about how I attack here, though. Maybe just Solarian there? But they would just shove Gingerbread in front and sack it. They're just gonna destroy me with Surge Engine, I think. Oh, they don't? Mistake. I don't know. Jin? At least I don't have mana that immediately buff search engine up either, but I can eat the food. Hmm. Could be in danger. My grandpa's deck has no stupid cards, it has Kellen. <laughs> Yeah. A regular guy that robs banks. Two. Just don't find something good, please. Gay's about to hit three instants. Mm, well. Oh, shit. No, that's not really what I'm looking for. I'm looking for Brotherhood's End. Oh, that's bad. Fuck. Oh. Uh. Uh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. 
and they can use that map to buff up their search engine. They don't attack? Oh my god, they're crazy. They're crazy. Ooh, there it is. Oh my god. Well, uh, okay, so we're gonna do... Solarian Terror, draw into Brotherhood's End. Vibes, okay. Maybe. Time to end Brotherhood's not true. That's <laughs> true. That just in this. Well, I'm afraid we we're gonna lose our uh, little Holly Gen too, huh? But um, well, yeah, that's what I'm thinking, huh? So if you do three damage, you remove Duff with you, you remove Tinder Brew, and you remove Larsness. Larsness gives you back Jin. Surge Engine survives. Sentinel survives. Spooner survives. You get a Jin. But also this Jin can attack again, which is very powerful too. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna do it on creatures actually. I'm thinking I'm going on creatures. No, they do gain life, so we have to be careful there. Okay, or not, I guess. We might then be in it. Because if they buff, they don't gain the life. They also forgot the crew, so yeah, I do win then. I mean, I don't know if crewing would have saved them, but I don't know. I have a other little gaze trying to dig for more. I mean, this is lethal, right? So, Whew. sheesh! <laughs> trying to beat cookies, fighting for my life out here. All right, so we got two lands, we got two questing druids. The Stellarian Terror seems pretty far. We have to witch off a Fendi too, though. Um, it's gonna really depend on these questing druids. I might try it. Yo, Logan! Thank you so much for the seven gifties! Well, you made it happen. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. <laughs> Where is it? Carl of Manor reading stream will happen. I guess when does the story come out fully? I'll make sure to- we're, we'll make sure to sit down and uh, have a story time. Thank you so much, appreciate you. When does it come out? Soon. Holy shit, mold of fire for opponent. Trench warfare. Thank you so much. Yeah, can we get some more spins in the chat? I'm gonna put some spins in the chat too. Here we go. Oh shit, tough cookie! I think I got a questing druid. I need to look for a land. Karma follows me. Um, I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. I, I do be a believer in good karma. I can remove teething roomlet here. I'm just gonna go for land drop, I think. I hope I don't regret it. Nah, I, I gotta. I gotta. Counter? Tamio? Counter. Alright. Daysa Redemption Arc. I'm slumming. I'm slumming Jin. I'm I don't care. I don't care. Naughty Jin. I remember when I called this thing Naughty Jin and people got offended by that. <laughs> and this economy? Oh shit, that's a sentinel. Oh my god. Trouble in paradise. Oh wait, why did I not book? Why did I attack with Cookie? I don't know. Warfare.
I don't know why I didn't pull the cookie. Shit. They're deaf gonna like animate, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That'd be bad. God, tough cookie's so good. Ah. Tough cookie is so good. What the hell? This is opponent on a mole of five, by the way. I'm like fighting for my life out here. Fighting for my life. I need to like, I need to find Strangle or Bolt or Traxxas Fall. I need to remove Tough Cookie. I wanna, if I want to have a shot at winning this game. Well, <laughs> well, okay. I guess so. I mean, I could get Spell Pierce actually. Let me not attack. It's not worth it. Oh my god. So why did Cliff die? Really? That'd be awful. I gotta try. Oh shit. Turn past. Alright, I'm gonna beans and gaze. Okay. Can we survive, gamers? New end? That's good. Okay. Come on now. Let's play this pop. Oh. We have other really brother roots end on artifacts. So that discounts it. Um, um, so this makes it two. Hmm. I do need the land. I think I gotta build like, like a little bit of war presence. Hold on. Hold on. So I'm gonna try druid. Wait, do I have a counter spell? Is this disruption? Wait. Holy shit. I mean, they did counter the absolute wrong card there, but. <laughs> Bruh. Oh shit. Every time I play against cookies, I realize how fucking strong it is. I also realize how people fuck up. Oh my god, this is not good though. Am I gonna go to two? No, brother. And this this could float, by the way. If they actually manage to like, oh my god! If they manage to put that out of three power range, which they do. Oh shit. How do I get out? I need to find, like, a Traxxas Fall. But then, it's also Word 1. Witch Stalker Frenzy might work? <laughs> oh 
man. Uh, this would go for one. I would draw into... Witch Stalker. But that would never be enough. No. It needs to be Witch Stalker to the top. It's never going to be enough anyway, though. I'm just screwed. <laughs> this sucks. I'm done. Cookies beat me. That makes sense. <sighs> like, I can... I can get rid of this. Like, I can pay for the ward costs, so... R.I.P. Close game, but... Cookie's death is stronger deck here. We really needed to hit like a Traxxas Fall there or something like that. 